That's uh, 19 minutes past eight. Uh, you may not know this name, Roger Dean. Not, not a name that I was familiar with, but you will be familiar potentially with his work. He was one of the most successful artists from the golden age of 70s classic rock. His landscapes were seen on millions of album covers and band posters all around the world. Well, now, more than 40 years later, he has a new plan to send some of his creations to space. David Filito went to meet him at his studio mm -hmm. in Sussex. Could be a hundred million. Um, we certainly counted. Hundred million. Yes, it, we certainly counted up to sixty-five million in the sixties and seventies. Back in the early seventies, when rock was on a cosmic journey, there was one artist that bands of a progressive persuasion turned to above all others: Roger D. But these aren't fantasy paintings. No, he says they're visions of possible future worlds that we might one day create ourselves. What I'm hoping to do is something that's inspirational. Yeah, I want people to think this is something we could do, this is something I want, and to want it and ask for it. Nearly 50 years on, he's still at work. This is new exhibition at Trading Boundaries in Sussex, but some of these visions of the future may be about to become reality. There are plans to build a Roger Dean spa, a Roger Dean village, and even a prototype moon base. It's got plants, it's got water. It's, the, it's a suggestion of what it might be like in a cave, because the proposal is to build it underground, under the surface. When the campaign to build a permanent settlement on the moon wanted an artist to create a vision of what might make living there bearable, they came to Roger. Plans are now afoot to build a prototype in Hawaii. Do you think there will be a Roger Dean moon base? I think there's a fair chance of it, yeah. On the moon? Why not? I think I think there's, there will be a moon base that I, I think there's a very good chance there will be a moon base on the moon, which I contributed to. This isn't then, he says, fantasy. It's just a reality that we haven't built yet. David Solito, BBC News, Lewis. Roger Dean, fantastic. What a studio study. I mean, you just want to move in there, don't well, you? Well, I just think, you know, all the artwork in there, all the books, it's just a really lovely space. Yeah. What a great life. And you're watching...